Are you troubled by strange noises in the night? Do you experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic? Have you or your family actually seen a spook, specter, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Just pick up the phone and call the professionals. Call the Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. We're, We're ready, ready to, to believe, believe you. you. Franchises available soon. Call for details. Whoa! Russell! Hey, man! You near the East Wing? Yep. But by the new ghost or exhibit? Yeah, why? There's something headed your way. Wait. I hear something. I'm gonna take a look. Wanna hear something really creepy? I was reading about Shandor, you know, the guy who donated most of the Gozer stuff. He was into the occult. You know, supernatural. Weird dude. <laughs> Uh, well, why don't we talk about it some other time? Any other time. Hey, you can't be in here. Stop! Is your haunting an apparition, poltergeist, phantasm wraith, banshee demon specter, the tortured soul of... What? No, we do not summon dead family members and catch them so you can ask the combination to the safe. Yeah, well, same to you, pal. Hey, it's the new cadet. Welcome aboard. This might be a little dangerous. Great. Danger is our life. We'll start at 50% capacity. That should keep any burning or tissue damage to a minimum. Hey, if you're gonna burn any tissue, do it to the new kid. You can't use Ray. Our mortgage is in his name. I guess he's right. What's your name again, kid? No names, Ray. I don't want to get too attached to this kid. You know, just in case. <laughs> you remember what happened to this guy. He's tuned and ready to go. You may feel a little tingle. Good. We've perfected an extensive and rigorous training regimen that will teach you all your equipment's basic functions. It takes some time to achieve master throw skill, but it's definitely worth the effort. Was that us? I don't think so. Ray? Had to be some sort of psi energy pulse. Substantial, a significant collected and centralized necromantic convulsion level 7 or more. Agreed. We need EMF measurement checks now. I know the answer, but I'm going to ask anyway. Is a level 7 uh, whatever bad or very bad? On a scale of 1 to 10, I would say... Let me guess. It's a 7. Let's just say we're about to get real busy. <laughs> And that is not the fun kind of getting busy, is it, Ray? Look out! Slimer's escaped again! No, wait, come back. How's it going, everyone? I'm Nice Headshot, and that was a pretty good intro for the game, I guess. Only Ghostbusters, the video game. One of the best movie games ever, in my opinion. Now, I did, I did, like, record a lot of footage for this game, but... I was using action, which I'm never using again because it fucked everything up for me. The audio and the video was out too out of sync. And when I tried to edit them together, it just didn't work properly as I wanted it to. So I'm there using this instead. Seems oddly drawn to the containment grid. He's been fascinated with it ever since you added the viewer to the unit. Okay, easy now, cadet. I'll talk you through this. Use the proton stream to get his attention. So yeah, Ghostbusters. No, not the containment unit. That's some highly <laughs> sensitive equipment you're disintegrating there, kid. Oops, you let one out. High voltage. 
I was fine tuning the interspatial gas. How does this work? I'll fix it. You two get those ghosts back. If you're a huge fan of the movies and the uh, original animated TV show, then on, you would, or TV shows, the you would love this game. Because, I mean, you have a proton pack. Okay. And you can move objects. Let's go get them. Oh, and uh, don't sweat the containment unit. It's easy to get excited your first time out with the proton stream. Egon will fix it in no time. Now I'm playing this on the normal mode, like the middle difficulty, and I'm using a controller because now, I don't like important. mouse controls of, of this you game. Get to know your proton pack. It can be your best friend out there in the field. Everything you need to know is displayed on the pack itself. Here's where you keep an eye on your current physical condition. The more green that's on the bar, the more damage you can sustain and still stay on your feet. This bar indicates your pack's heat level. When it gets to the top, you'll want to bend the pack and keep it from shorting out and resetting. For the most part, capturing a ghost is pretty straightforward. We break it into three basic steps. Sap them, cap them, and trap them. Spectral entities derive all their strength from an accumulation of PK energy. Blasting them with your proton stream or other offensive equipment helps to dissipate that energy. Dissipating their PK energy also makes them easier to capture. Okay. Do it again! See that overlay on the ghost? It indicates the current accumulation of a ghost PKE. The more you disperse, the weaker it becomes. Gotta get him. Come on, get him. Ooh, we lost Slimer. There it is! Ugh, and I thought Slimer was disgusting. Oh, he's... Ah, uh, don't vomit at me. Pack's moving into the red, can yep. I vent it? Yep, I'm venting that shit. Busting makes me feel good, so that's always a plus. This game actually has pretty tight controls, and um, very very good story and everything else. Come on, stop hiding behind the box. Just let me knock him out. Give it a shot. There you go. Perfect. Good looking, Cowboy. Make sure your pack slam meter is charged. Let him have it. Whammo. You play rough, kid. I love it. Finally. Yep, come on. Get him in the trap. Go. trap. Very nice, cadet. You've got some real promise. Oh, and always remember to retrieve your trap. Did you get them? Yes, uh, we got them. Slimer slipped out. Our cadet bagged his first one, though. A very nasty customer. Oh, and you've got to be very careful about crossing the streams. In a word, don't do it. Seriously. Stings like the Dickens, too. Hey, how come this mum gets all the new stuff? He's our new experimental equipment technician. He gets a cool title, too? It means he gets to carry around a bunch of untested, extremely Yay! dangerous hardware. That I get to blow up if something goes wrong with the equipment. New Jersey. Oh, this knucklehead lugs around our very dangerous prototype hardware that could potentially blow us into New Jersey. Thanks. Keep the title, kid. It'll work hard for you. Thank you. Scooter. We need to go. Let's roll. Yep, I know mean, guys, that is part one of this video series. If you enjoyed it, give it a like, subscribe for more, and it will help you keep up so you know when my videos will upload, which I'm trying to do on a regular basis. 
by recording as much as I can in a day and uploading Go two videos, oh, one or two videos a day, maybe every two days. So one or two videos every two days, probably. You'll get at least four videos a week. That, that's that's that, that's my goal: four videos a week, which you know is pretty pretty good. While I'm just sliding around. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching, and as always, I've been Nesho. Have a good day.